me with uh, my first black belt, Gary Tonin. Uh, a lot of times people throw around the word loyalty, and I know it's been talked about before. Uh, and, and what I've said basically is loyalty is a two-way street, you know. Uh, I'm as, as much as Gary is loyal to me, I'm loyal to him. I would do anything for him, and I know he would do anything for me. But I also understand, uh, as many of you guys know, he trains with John Danaher all the time. I was in the city every day, and that's something that I completely support because I want the best for Gary. Uh, I want him to, you know, expand his knowledge and, and just become better and better. And even though he's still, you know, he's in the city all the time, every day. I talk to this guy every day. We train all the time. Uh, I'm on his ass every day. Uh, you know, and he still respects me as his professor. And uh, I think nowadays we see a lot of people expect loyalty, but they're not giving their loyalty back. Your thoughts on it? Yeah, I mean, uh, for sure. Like, I mean, one of the things that I always, that I was always, you know, kind of seeing as I was coming up, you know, you'd see some people that were truly, you know, truly loyal and, tr and were truly there, truly there for you. And you could tell, you could tell not just by the things that they say. It's, it's not about, you know, me saying, oh, I'm loyal to you, I'm, you know, whatever the case may be. It's what they do, you know, uh, how people act. You know, you see when they're there for you. When you call them up in the middle of the night and say, hey, man, you know, I need something. Um, they don't even hesitate. They don't go, oh, I got to check. They just go, yeah, man, I'm there. Guys, like I've had, you know, guys from even from Tom's school, Carlos, who I just trained with today, he came to my, uh, up and drove up to me uh, on New Year's Eve to fix my car. He didn't have to do that. In the middle of the night, New Year's Eve, drove up to fix my car. Dude's, dude's got a bunch of kids that he's got to take care of and everything like that. He found a way to get there to help me, you know, because he's loyal to me. I'm loyal. To, I, if I had some way to do that, I can't fix a car. I don't know what I could do for Carlos, but whatever it is, I would gladly do it. I'd lay my life down for the guy because I know he's loyal and he's shown me that. You know, the same way that, that I am for Tom and, you know, the people around me that show me their loyalty for me. That's what it is, guys. If you expect some kind of respect and loyalty, you got to give that respect and loyalty. You can't just expect it and not give it. You know, I've, I've been a loyal <coughs> dog to my teacher since I've been with him in the beginning. And unless he told me not to be, right, I will be until the day I die. You know, so guys, I hope you get something from this. Uh, good luck, Gary. Uh, I'm going to compete in two weeks. And, uh, Thanks for training today, guys.